guys, it is Faith. Welcome back to another video on my channel. For today's video, I'm gonna be giving you guys my desk setup tour. I recently upgraded my setup and I wanted to show you guys what it looks like because I think I got it to the way that I like it and that's the most functional for me. In case you guys aren't familiar, I am a freelance social media manager and video editor, so I'm always sitting here all day every day in front of the computer. So definitely having a place that was very functional and clean and to my liking it was very important to me so I hope you guys enjoy watching and without further ado let's get right on into the tour okay so I think the first thing I'm going to show you guys is my chair I have this iconic pink gaming chair I've had this for quite a few years now I actually got this chair when I started doing online school if you guys are familiar with those videos it is just so comfortable I can literally sit here for long hours if I wanted to and I do it comes with two little pillows so one is like a back pillow a head pillow these little armrests lift and go down the chair goes up and down but my favorite part is that it has a little foot rest thing. It's so cool because I can just put my feet up and I can lay all the way down flat in this chair. So I can literally nap or like sleep here if I wanted to. It literally goes all the way down like a dentist chair. So I absolutely love this. If I could change one thing about it, I wish it was heated for these cold winter mornings. But you can literally get this chair off of Overstock, Wayfair, Walmart, Target, Amazon even. So I am going to link a really similar one down below. On to the actual desk. I got this for Christmas last year. It is a oak table stand-up desk. I got this off Amazon. I used to have like a glass like L-shaped desk, which I absolutely loved. My favorite part about that was that I had a dry erase marker. I would literally like write notes and doodle all over it. I also have thought of getting a stand-up desk that was glass, but it was going to take forever to ship. It was way too expensive and I absolutely love this one way more. You can have little presets on the side, you can manually do it up and down, and overall it's just a really good desk. I really love the light wood color. I definitely want to add more like wood tones to my bedroom, so this is a great way to set the tone. The next thing I'm going to talk about is my computer. This is an iMac. I actually unboxed this on my channel way long ago, but I am thinking about upgrading this iMac to the newest one. I haven't pulled the trigger on it yet, but I don't know if I need to clear up my storage or if this iMac is getting too old, but it's slowing down. But I do a lot of video editing on this computer and a bunch of other things. So it's super important for me to have like a really fast computer and all. So it might not be in the actual setup for long, but as of right now, I have this iMac. And then down on the dock, I have a Lacey hard drive. I have client videos. I have my personal YouTube videos. I have like YouTube video assets. So like the overall branding and the music and like the little pop-ups you see here and there, it's on this hard drive. So it's always plugged in in here. And then I have like this OG old Mac mouse. So it still works and I just keep it here for now in case my other mouse dies because this actually dies pretty quick. For my keyboard, I just have the standard like Mac keyboard. I have thought about getting a mechanical keyboard at one point because I feel like it would be so like aesthetic, you know? I feel like anyone who has done a desk setup tour or like does like desk videos like this or even on Instagram, they have like a nice mechanical keyboard. Thought about getting one before, but I feel like after a while the sound of it would just be annoying. But I love the idea of like chunky keys, like typing away, because I do a lot of typing on here. But for now, I have this, and then I have just the standard Mac Magic Mouse. And then my mouse pad is from Target. It used to have polka dots at one point. And then my iMac is just sitting on this little glass platform that I got from Amazon. When I had my other desk, it was glass as well, so it flowed really well, and I just wanted my Mac to like be raised a little bit higher. So now that I have the stand up desk, I don't necessarily need it, but just for aesthetics purposes, I have this here. Absolutely love it. I think it was like 20 bucks on Amazon. And then underneath, I have this little tray of just like very miscellaneous things. So in here, I have a couple camera batteries. I have a system of like where to put my batteries when they need to be charged and when they're fully charged. So I have the fully charged right here. When you're filming a lot, you have to have batteries on deck. So it's just in one place. And then I have a memory card. I have this little attachment for my camera on where the microphone goes. So I don't need that right now. 
I have this little stand for your phone so you can like put it down on the table and then you put your phone on the stand and it's like easier to watch a video when you're on a table. My mom is probably looking for this so mom it's right here. <laughs> and then I have this little dongle for my phone just in case I need it for some odd reason. And then I have a little clicker for taking Instagram photos for my phone. Super easy to take photos by yourself if you have like a self timer or like a little clicker like this. So just chill in there. Next, I'm gonna go over here for a second. So I have a MacBook Pro right here. I just recently got a new case for it. This is from Velvet Caviar. It's little coffees on it. If you guys know, you know I love my coffee so much. I have the Velvet Caviar coffee collection pretty much, I think. I have one for my phone, my AirPods, I have a keychain, and now my laptops. So just like I have the whole Apple ecosystem, I have the whole coffee collection ecosystem as well and then my laptop is just sitting on this little laptop stand I got from Amazon super super recently I was like it's about time I get one of these I've heard great things about it you just basically put it on your table and then when you're working it gives yourself a better posture when you're typing especially for your wrist it's so much better for it so um, I got this I absolutely like it so far I've only had it for a few days but behind that I have my headphones so these are from Razer I believe they're like the Rose Quartz color they're just basically pink razor headphones I used to be so into gaming I used to play Fortnite all the time I even streamed it at one point so I had to get some good gaming headphones just like I have a good gaming chair so I use these to this day just for editing or like listening to music on my computer super comfortable I can wear these for long hours as well I just love that they're pink I feel like everything in my room is so neutral and I've done my best to keep everything pretty neutral but I still love pink pink is my favorite color and I just have to have pops of pink somewhere in my room so it's my headphones and my gaming chair and then it's just on this little headphone stand I got from Amazon forever ago I honestly it's probably like 12 or 15 bucks so I just keep it back there and then I also forgot to mention the desk also has like a little hole to pull cables through which is really cool if I wanted to I can remove these little things for more space so just another like really nice detail about my desk okay last but definitely not least I have this little side of my desk so over here I actually have a Google Home Mini I typically use it to stream lo-fi music from my computer so lo-fi music is just streaming all day every day unfortunately it's not connecting to like my phone or my computer right now I might have to like reset it so it's just chilling there for right now but I also use this to turn on and off my big lamp and sometimes to set an alarm if I'm just like feeling it. I don't have a lot of Google products. Again, I'm an Apple kind of gal, so it can only do very limited capabilities. But next to it, I have this glow ball lamp. I saw someone on TikTok have this on their nightstand and I thought it was such like a sleek, minimal like way to like decorate a nightstand just like one simple lamp and then like a book so I absolutely love that this changes colors I got it from Home Depot actually for like 25 bucks so it's like a little eight inch ball lamp I absolutely love it again it changes colors and I'm all about my lighting I have this little ball lamp I have a main lamp that I use that changes colors my oil diffuser changes colors so I just love all of my lighting. Everything is so cohesive. It's also so much fun to like work at night if I want to. I'm such a night person. So having my room lit up in different colors while it's dark out is just such a vibe. So going down to the bottom of my desk, I'm actually going to raise this up. You get a little live presentation. Super quiet, by the way. Okay, so I don't know if you can really see from under here, but there's a little wired basket that the desk came with. It just stores some of the um, motor cables. But I also have this little, um, I guess, like surge protector um, box. So I plug all of my devices in here, and whenever the power spontaneously goes out, it protects the surges against like electronics, and it has a battery in it, so it can last like up to an hour and a half of battery life which is honestly a blessing so I have this here and then the cable management is not the best right now I'm well aware at least all of the cables are like 
strapped together but I need a better way to do cable management so for right now it looks like this but this is only temporary and then last but not least I have this little yoga mat right here I originally bought it because I wanted to do like more yoga or like Pilates in my room but I also thought it was a great idea to use it as a floor mat for when I actually stand up because standing up on the hard plastic hurts my feet over a while so just putting a little yoga mat down helps a lot so I just keep that right here for now but other than that that's like pretty much it for my whole setup so that is my full completed desk setup tour. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. I hope I gave you some inspiration for your desk in your home or your office or your home office now. But if you enjoyed, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Comment below if you want more like productivity videos or like work videos, not like, or like desk like productivity videos. I've seen a lot of them on YouTube recently and they're very aesthetically pleasing. So if you want more videos to do with all of the tech and aesthetics of everything make sure you give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below everything will be linked down in the description and then my socials are also linked down below as well so if you want to follow my day-to-day -day life i'm always on instagram but with that i hope you guys have a wonderful day and i'll see you guys in my next vlog really soon bye